Let me tell you uh, the worst thing about being a fat middle-aged comedian, because I am, let's not, let's not mess around. I'm, look, look at what I've done to myself. <laughs> I mean, I look pregnant, it's ridiculous. <laughs> and you know the worst thing about that? is that comedy attracts young, beautiful people. So you come out and you see really attractive, beautiful people and you feel like a fraud when you look like this. Which is why I was so relieved when I came out tonight <laughs> and saw such a sea of ruined middle-aged losers. <laughs> <laughs> Who's over 40 here? Listen to the misery in those cheers. <laughs> and who's under 25? Yes! Yes! Yes, all right, well, shut up! <laughs> There's not many of us. We'll take you down with sheer bitterness. <laughs> you don't know what's coming, you people. You don't know what's going <laughs> to happen to me backstage. This isn't my original outfit. I was wearing a tight black T-shirt, and the producer had asked me to change. <laughs> Because he said I looked like a bin bag full of coleslaw. <laughs> That's a quote. <laughs> My body is... it's disgusting. <laughs> I looked at myself naked in the mirror about two hours ago before I came here. I stood in front of the... Uh, don't woo that, for God's sake. <laughs> I, I looked at myself naked in a mirror and I thought, genuinely, I thought to myself, you know what that looks like? My body looks like it's been carved by a four-year-old child out of a budget block of ham. <laughs> Just a rough approximation of a male boy. It's all pink and mottled. It's disgusting. <laughs> I wasn't going to tell you this. I'll tell you this. Do you know what happened to me the other day? Get this. This is true. I broke my toilet. Guess how? I'll tell you. I just sat on it. <laughs> it's ruined. It's come a totally away from the wall. I just sat on it. So then I was halfway through a poo, right? So I had to do this waddle of shame through the flat to the guest toilet. I sat on that. I swear to God, that broke too. 